A little bittersweet moment for Andrew Seliscar. This is going to be his final swim at the NCSA Junior Nationals. He's been doing some fantastic things so far in, the, in his history here. Let's see if he can wrap it up with a win in what's not really his best event. But he's definitely going to have to do some damage here. Let's set the lanes. Cody Bollinger in lane number one from Poseidon Swimming. In lane number two from Metro Atlanta Aquatic Club is Dean Ferris. In lane three from Marlins of Raleigh, Justin Ress. Four, Andrew Seliscar, Nation's Capital Swim Club. Five, James Jones, Nation's Capital Swim Club. Stephen Mount is in lane number six from Greater Pensacola. Townley Haas is in lane number seven from Nova of Virginia. And in lane eight, Mark McLaughlin from Iowa Flyers Swim Club. James Jones is the more established 50 freestyler. Andrew Seliscar, again, not known for 50 freestyle. But when he goes to Cal Berkeley next year, he's going to probably be asked to do a lot of 200 free relays. So he's definitely got to start being a 50 freestyler now. All right. And there's a hush over the field, over the auditorium. And here we go. James Jones in five, Andrew Seliscar in four. In four. Seliscar, the great kick out, got a little bit of a lead. James Jones pulling even. This is going to be too close to call. It's going to be James Jones gets the win. 22-84. Almost a lifetime best. Justin Ress gets second, 23.09. And that gets him into Olympic trials. Third place with Selitzgar, 23.15. Townley Haas was fourth, 23.32. You know, Townley's been having some illnesses earlier this week, and it's great to see him bounce back. 23.32 is a great swim. Congratulations to James Jones. It's not an upset, but it's still a great swim for him.